Welcome to the Lotus Goddess to my love. Hi everyone, how's everyone doing today? Hope you're doing well and staying safe. Welcome back everyone. Welcome if you're new to my channel. I do Divine Mask and Divine Feminine Twin Flame Journey Chart Readings. Now let's begin and just keep in mind that this is a general reading. So I already pulled out the charms. I haven't read them yet. But we'll see what message comes through. Somebody's trying to dial a phone number here. I see constantly dialing, dialing, but not being able to get through. It's a home phone number, so it's like a landline number, not a cell phone. So I see here calling somebody's house, but not able to get through. Could be long distance, calling long distance. Could be wrong number. But I see here something about trying to call a contact. They're calling a number that they've had for some time. Who's they? Uh, this is a divine masculine trying to reach out to somebody. Trying to call a number that they had for some time. They probably assume that this person still has this number. Or if it's long distance, they're just not able to get through. Could be somebody's home. I do see home number, home, house, where they're living at. This call is supposed to be something very pleasant. I see here trying to start a good conversation. There, there will not be any expression of love, meaning that when they call this person, they're not going to say what they really feel, like why they're calling. But I see here that they're going to call this person to kind of like get conversation going. But they're not going to really speak as openly as they should. They're not going to express themselves. The person on the other end, if they eventually reach them or talk to them, I feel like they will kind of like question and they will have a question in their mind. Like, why did my mask and call? Like, what's the, what's the real reason? But I don't see my mask on sharing anything here. This looks like Divine Mask is calling. Some family member. I feel it's a family member. Maybe they haven't been talking to a sibling for some time. Or it could be a parent. But it's like trying to reach out to them. Talk to them. It feels like just to have that connection again, just to be reminded of what home feels like. Because this masculine may have caused some sort of distance between them and the family members. I feel it was Divine Masculine's choice because I see here, Divine Masculine is the one who's returning. Returning back into this person's life. Yes, it could be long distance. I do see her distance now. It's emotional. It, it is an emotional thing for this Divine Masculine to do. On the other end, if they do eventually reach that person, so that family member, if they do pick up the call or they are able to... I, yeah, I see family here. So if they do pick up the call, it's going to be a little bit emotional on both ends, but I feel like Divine Masculine will not um, let them know like say, for example, if Divine Mask is calling a sibling, right? And the sibling is, realizes, oh, this is my, you know, Divine Masculine, right? And they will get emotional over the phone, but Divine Masculine will, they will shed tears, but Divine Masculine will not um, let the other person know that they are also, you know, sad or, or emotional about the phone call. They're not going to openly express what they really feel. And I feel like this uh, this call will be easy for them to do because they're hiding behind the call. Like this person won't be able to see them. So it's not a visual. It's just sound. It's just the phone itself, the phone call. That's why I see something landline here, like landline house, direct house number. 
So it's not going to be like a call, like a video call or, um, or something like uh, over the internet. It will be, you know, direct phone number. It's like some of you might be like, who has that nowadays, right? <laughs> but I do see, so it's not going to resonate for all, but I do see calling somebody's house, like a home number. Could be like that, that's the home base, meaning that that's the main house, that's the main family house. This is where maybe Divine Masculine grew up. This is maybe their parents' home and their number will never change. Or maybe um, they always keep the number. They may have cell phones, but they still keep their home number, right? So that's that's what I see. Something about calling the main home, home, line, home. There will be, following this, there will be a trip. So if this masculine is at distance from their family, I see here, um, this phone call will result in wanting to meet them, see them. It's like it's going to bring this longing for Divine Masculine to want to see their family again, to see them in person. It's like, I can't do this phone call. I want to see them. I want to meet them. I want to talk to them. I, I do see here, spending money for a trip. Spending money for a trip to meet with family members. Uh, this is going to be something that's unexpected. This is not planned. This is not planned by Divine Mask. It's just going to be like instant, just in the moment. It's like, you know what? I'm just going to buy a ticket and go. So this is not going to be planned. I see here it's not pre-planned. This is something that Divine Mask is just going to make a quick decision that, you know what? I have to see my family. I need to see them. I need to go home. There's going to be um, messages. I see here messages, um, information spread out. A lot of people are going to be talking about this. Family members will be sharing with other family members who they trust. So not every single person is going to know. But this news is going to spread that masculine's coming home. This masculine's planning to come home. Let's see, Divine Feminine, if you're in this reading, because I see a lot of masculine and, and connecting with loved ones, family reaching out I do see something about when they go home this divine masculine is going to be reminded constantly about divine feminine it may not be reminded by other people but it's just like going home that environment could be like for example that city specific city it's like wow I remember I used to sit in this coffee shop and talk to divine feminine on the phone or I remember when I used to you know go there for lunch and divine feminine used to call me and I would say hey I'm having lunch at so and so restaurant you see so there are going to be constant reminders of you divine feminine when this divine masculine returns home if we were living in that same area that's even stronger that <laughs> that connection is going to be much more stronger because you're in very close prox proximity right energetically but i do see here there will be constant reminders of the past of divine masculine divine feminine divine masculine is going to have constant reminders of the past with their divine feminine it's going to build a stronger connection. I see you're building a stronger connection. Things will be revealed more in detail, better understanding about the situation, better understanding about where Divine Feminine was coming from, meaning when you used to share certain things, what you meant um, at the time when you used to share certain information or stories or um, guidance for Divine Masculine, maybe at the time Divine Masculine didn't understand. They didn't understand what you were, where you were coming from. What did you mean? But... Returning home, it's like everything it everything comes into perspective. They understand that, oh, this is what they meant because there's a maturity. The, this masculine has changed a bit. So coming home, they are going to see things from another point of view. They're going to recall certain conversations that they had. It's like, yeah, I remember that day when I went to, you know, um, pick up my clothes from the dry cleaners did I remember that I said something and then divine feminine and I we had a disagreement right so they're going to remember that disagreement they're going to remember why that happened and what you meant that day right so at the time they probably thought like why did we have that disagreement right why did that happen and they didn't think much of it but now when they see that dry cleaners, they're going to recall that conversation it's like this is what divine feminine meant and I should have I should have known better i should have understood divine feminine a little bit better i should have heard them out see so it's going to bring you two closer 
even if you two are not in conversation because I don't see conversation here, but there's something about memories of you that is going to bring them closer to you because there's going to be a better understanding about what happened, why why you said certain things, what you meant, why he, Divine Masculine reacted a certain way. They're going to see themselves in a different way now. Divine Masculine is going to see themselves as, now I understand why I reacted that way. And I was, that was a different time. And they're going to understand why you said certain things to them. Because at the time they didn't have that, I would say, spiritual maturity at that time. To understand where you were coming from. Because what you said had a lot of depth. I see here you had a lot of depth and strength in you. I, I see Divine Feminine here in the past. You came in as a queen. Right? And Divine Masculine was not a king yet. You were the queen. Divine Masculine was not the king. Divine Masculine was, I would say, a joker. <laughs> you know, ha ha ha, the joke's on Divine Masculine. <laughs> but, you know, coming back to that uh, that moment, it's like flashbacks of what happened, what was said, what was done. It's like, wow, the joke was on me. Divine Masculine is like, wow, the joke was on me. So now this Divine Masculine has stepped into a different kind of energy. This is the energy of a king, a little bit more loyalty, a little bit more compassion, understanding. And then taking on that energy of the king, taking on that responsibility of the connection, understanding where they should be coming from. What should I be giving to this connection? What is expected of me as the king? So this is the reading for today. I hope you like this reading. If you like my readings, please subscribe to my channel. Leave a comment below. And thank you all for watching. Have a beautiful day. Bye.